Hi everyone, this is Carl Gronagrover14 here and we're back on MotoGP15 carrying on with the challenge we started of trying to make it from Moto3 up to the GP bikes. Now in the last race we managed to get a victory and it's thrown us a lifeline to try and challenge for those honours in the Moto3. Now in this next race we really want to get another decent qualifying uh, place. Hopefully we can challenge for, uh, for another podium to really try and get in that top spot. I really want to get a victory in this first season in the Moto3, so here we go. Hello to all the bike racing fans tuning in. The Moto3 race is about to get underway here at the Circuit de Barcelona, Catalunya for the seventh event on the calendar. The skies over the track are clear. So we're in Spain, a Barcelona. Now this is a half decent circuit, really fast. It's got some tricky sections on it, but hopefully I can get a decent qualifying and uh, hopefully get a decent uh, position on the grid. Right, let's check the bike quickly. We've got one data pack to use. What should we use it on? Um, what do I want to improve on this bike? Um, should we put it on the brakes? Yeah, we put it on the brakes. Right, so let's get into the race. Hopefully you can get a good qualifying. Right, it wasn't the best qualifying, guys. I only managed to get sick from the grid, but that's hopefully good enough to put us in a position that we can challenge for the top, for at least a podium finish. So here we go. Right, hopefully we can get a good start. We really want to carry on from the amazing victory we had in the last race. We want to keep pace with the top two, with the points. So I think three would be the minimum requirement I think here right, let's try and get a good start going into this first bend it's quite a tricky one it's all good too a bit wide lean it over right let's just try and keep with these uh, four in front of us for the first lap if we can pass and we will bad Oh, no, can't hold it. Right, can we take him on the outside? Oh, bloody hell, bit of a collision there. It's up to P4. Bloody hell, I lost it again, he's gone on the inside of me. Don't knock me off. So far, so good. It's a good start. Right, oh god, slam the brakes on there. Tricky section here. Well, I'm happy with this so far as long as we keep them in sight and uh, hopefully get in. Well, in the next couple of laps, we can hopefully speed up a bit. Oh, I did. Mucked it up there. Totally wasn't in the right position for that corner there, but we've recovered. Come on. Really enjoying this game now, guys. Now I've got, got in the swing of it. De definitely re recommend it. It's a massive improvement from uh, MotoGP 14. Right, come on, let's chase these guys down. Oh, look, still, even with the upgrades, they've still got so much more speed on the on the straights. Look, see? Let's catch me up. Right, let's try and get a good corner here. Carry some decent speed. Oh, God. Wasn't great. Oh, I'm falling behind now, P6. We need to catch up again. Come on, let's nip at the inside of him. Probably we can get a better time this lap. We need to catch up. I want to at least come third. Come on. Take it a bit better. That's it. Stand it up. Power. Must admit it, the bike does feel a lot better around the corners with well with some of the upgrades. But I think uh, once we get to maximum we'll see what we're really made of. I'm still not sure whether I'm gonna buy 
the custom t do the custom thing. I might just leave it to the Moto GP bikes, or I might do it in the Moto too. I'm not sure yet. We're definitely building those credits up. Right, come on. Got to catch these guys up. Coming into the uh, end of this uh, second lap. I don't want to be lagging behind going into that last lap otherwise we're not going to get a podium place right come on oh, this is much better I think I can take these two guys now try to get them here can get the inside oh brilliant move right up to P4 so we're one place away from a podium finish oh no see again just too much speed on the straights going to have to get more uh, catch well let's catch them up in the, in the corners definitely quicker on some of the corners than they are just not on the straights right go on up to Pete Paul can we get Pete yes into third no can we hold it no right let's try and defend this I'll be happy to finish in third he's going to push me all the way this guy that's in Pete oh look bloody get no more than that Let's... we can catch these two guys right just push them I want to win didn't think I'd get this close to him look half a lap left oh, this is gonna be don't know whereabouts we can pass and know some tricky bends coming up So I don't want to come off. And we can catch him. Starting to get a bit twitchy here. Getting a bit nervous. Can I do it? Come on. Let's do a Rossi style pass. Go into the corner at high speed and be good on the brakes. Come on. That's good. Hold it. Oh, took them on the outside. Can I? Oh, bloody hell. Collision. Can I hold it? He's going to take me. Bugger. We're up to P2, though. Can't get me. Inside. Oh, got him. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Oh, what an amazing pass, guys. We're going to win the race as well. Have that. What a victory. I am so chuffed. I didn't even think I was going to do that. That's an absolutely amazing victory. That's... That's well, really put us up into the, uh, Here's the final well, back into the championship race. Right, let's check the standings. Oh, look at that. We're up to second. 14 points behind. That's awesome. Right, so we're up to a level 10. Unlocked some more stuff that we have to look at. Some gloves and crash helmets right more credits brilliant let's build those credits up so we've got enough to get the best bike in the, in this uh, division but like I said I might wait till Moto 2 you can yes his victory I am victorious get in if we can get another race like that guys I'm going to really hopefully get into that first position right I'm not sure what the next track is Right, let's get into the next race. Right, so we're actually up to the round that they've just passed in real life in the MotoGP series. And uh, yeah, Rossi got a really decent win on the circuit. So hopefully we can uh, follow suit and do the same. It is a very tricky circuit with some really tight bends. But it has got some nice uh, speedy sections as well. So hopefully we can get a decent uh, qualifying again and challenge for those podium places. It'd be really good if we can get the top three again. Right, let's get into this race. And welcome to the eighth event of the Moto3 season. Today we're here in Assen, where the Dutch Grand Prix will be getting underway any moment now. 
The weather is fine and the temperature is perfect for racing. So we're just waiting to find out which riders have opted for hard tyres and which have gone for the soft. Right, let's quickly check our bike development. I think we've got some packs to use. Right, we've got three to use. I might shove them all on suspension. This is a tricky circuit, so we need all the help we can get. Right, let's put that to level three. Hopefully we will see the, uh, oh, we'll get, gain some benefit from this. We're gonna need all the help we can get on this circuit. Right, let's get into the race. Right guys, I had an absolute awful qualifying. I only managed 18th position on the grid, and that's not great. So hopefully we can find some race pace and hopefully challenge for those uh, top three places. Right, here we go. Right, we're really gonna have to pull it off a miracle here, guys. We're really gonna have to try and take as many of these riders in the first couple of corners, because otherwise we're not gonna get anywhere near those podium positions. Right, here we go. To really try and snap up the inside here. Be really careful. I don't want to come off. Whoa! God, we had a bit of a moment there. I went way too fast into that corner. Don't know how I managed to stay on. Right, come on, let's do it again. What a move. I think I took someone off there, but never mind. I've been penalised for it. Right, hold it, hold it. Went a bit wide. Back on the track. What? That's the start we wanted, guys. Up to P6. We've got a chance of getting into those podium positions. Early days, but this is looking good. Right. Let's try and catch up with the uh, leading pack. Got it. Oh, this is looking good. We're showing that we've got, we've got the speed around these bends. I don't want to make any mistakes now. Oh, bloody hell. Almost went straight into that guy there. Right, we're up to P5 if we can hold it. We're giving ourselves a real chance here. This is an amazing first lap. Can't don't ruin it. P4. Oh, this is good. If we can hold it here going into the last lap, we can maybe uh, hopefully pull off a miracle and get into those top three places. Right, this is uh, coming up to that tricky last corner. It's not. I came off a couple of times in qualifying here. Don't want to muck it up. Oh, bloody hell, that's difficult. We're on the bike. Right. Let's try and uh, up our game and uh, go a bit faster now. Keep it tight. Don't want to lose touch with these guys in front. Fourth is no good. It's not enough points. Come on. Come on. Let's try and take him on this corner. Oh god, can I take them both? Up to Brilliant, up to P2. I cannot believe how I'm riding, considering I only qualified in 18th. I had I didn't have the speed at all in the qualifying. I think my fastest lap in qualifying was 149. Let's see if we can improve on that. I think uh, I think the guy in first in qualifying got a 140 high 146.9. I think. Let's see if we can get close to that. All right, if we can hold this. Second would be good. I don't think I've got the speed to win it. I think he's. I don't know. Within the shout, if we can have another good first section of the third uh, of the third lap, seems to be good around those first two corners. Right, let's not muck it up on this uh, last bit of the court, last chicane. It's really challenging. Right, let's try and do a bit better than we did last time. Not too bad. Oh God. So what time we can just do the slap in. Oh, we did a 147. That's definitely much quicker than qualifying. Right. He's just pulled away. He's got about a, just over a second lead. 
and this guy in third is really put me under pressure just need to hold it second would be good I don't want to make any mistakes there's no point pushing it and ruining the race yeah look we're 1.2 seconds behind I think that's going to be too much for me to catch up with I think we'll do our best though remember what Rossi did mind you uh, I think it was more like um, Mar Marquez was trying to mug him on that last that last section and sent him into the gravel <laughs> if we can do something similar that would be amazing we need to get a bit closer though going into this last bit can't really push it come on come on Faster. God, are we going to get closer? Going to the last bit? Oh. Should we try and mug him on this last corner? Can we do it? Oh, i going to carry a lot of speed. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, what a bloody pass. Oh, how amazing, guys. Oh, I cannot believe I just won that. Unbelievable. What a turnaround! Out of the blue, last section went in, went into that corner hot. Managed to stand the bike up and took him on the last bend. That is what you call racing. That was amazing, and that's pushed straight. Oh, look at that! We're only, we're only nine points behind the championship as well. This is absolutely amazing. I cannot believe that. <laughs> Oh god, my heart is absolutely pounding. I cannot believe I did that. Well, that race has definitely put us back into the title race for sure now. I cannot believe and what a turnaround this has been. And uh, hopefully we can do the same in the next round. Right, let's go and see what, what's coming up next. Here we go. The other riders will really find it hard. Well, we really deserve the uh, celebrations here. That's uh, take it all in. That was so close. That's two races that we've just won out at the end. <laughs> we really are mucking these guys off here. <laughs> right, that brings us to the end of another part. And those, those races today were really thrilling. I really enjoyed that. This game is absolutely living up to expectations. I think it's much better than MotoGP 14. And if you are enjoying it too, please hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and I will see you soon for the next part. Thank you very much for watching. Bye.